Hey guys, it's Jake from hookahdomain.com. Tonight we're going to be showing you how we disassemble and clean our 26 inch rotator hookah. Um, first what we do is we start off by disconnecting the hose, setting that aside. Remove the hose grommet. I like to keep that in a small bowl so that we don't lose it. Next, we remove the bolt, dump out the coals, remove the foil, clean out all the tobacco that's stuck inside the bowl. You can throw this away in the trash or you can just put it down the garbage disposal. Once you wipe all the tobacco out, run warm water through the bottom of the bowl. Use a sponge, wipe out the inside of the bowl. Get a nice rinse, set it aside to dry. Next, we're going to remove our ashtray from the stem, shake the ashes out of it. Also, rinse it with warm water. You can also use a sponge or scrubber to wipe the, uh, the ash off of the bowl, bottom and top. It just gives it a, a better shine. Once you're done there, set that aside as well. On the rotator, we're going to unscrew the stem from the base. Dump the water out. That's from the melted ice in the ice chamber. Remove our grommet. Rinse it off and put it aside. Next what we're going to do is we're going to simply rinse off the entire stem. Also rinse off the ice chamber. What I like to do is I like to run a little bit of vinegar through the stem. Run our stem brush through it. It's going to be a pain in the butt to pull out sometimes. Okay. Run the stem to both sides of the stem brush to both sides of the stem. Run some more water through our stem to rinse it. Okay. Rinse the outside of the stem and set it aside to dry. Next, remove the base from this, the rotator stand. Rinse the stand off. Set it aside. Empty out our base. Run half water. Half vinegar. Shake it a little bit to kind of get everything kind of clean all around. Empty it. And again, rinse water through a few more times. That way you get all the vinegar smell out. And set everything aside to dry. The hose, what I usually like to do is I just like to blow some air through it. Sometimes run a little water. Let it run out the other side. And then set the hose up to dry. This has been Jake with hookahdomain.com showing you how to clean a rotator hookah.